Welcome back, insufferable human fans. Your old pal Rosser here, and we have just scored ourselves a rib, which I assure you is great smothered in barbecue sauce with some pinto beans and a nice, cheap Boone's Farm wine. Yows, how did I dodge that? Oh, right, I didn't. So close. Let's just get the hell out of here before the spiders start causing me some sort of complex. Which in my case would be more like a simplex. I assure you there's nothing complex about this. You whip the monsters, you eat their hearts. You occasionally get knocked backwards. Hopefully not into a pit. Alright. We got ourselves a town here. Remember when I said that this holy water kicks ass? It'll just burn the floor right out of your house. You got linoleum? Well, if you got a red-clad buddy that's a fixin' to fight Dracula, he's got some holy water, you can just freaking kiss your linoleum goodbye. Okay, this garlic, it is a very good investment, however, however, there are some other things that I'm going to need first. Actually, it would behoove me to get the garlic now, but it would not behoove me enough to skip the other things at which I would like to purchase. Like, uh, I think there's going to be a chain whip somewhere around here. Hopefully it'll be right here. And I think it's 150 hearts. Do I have 100? I have 150 hearts. Trust me, the chain whip will be well worth my while. And this is not the chain whip guy. This is... Some creepy dude. A lot of people say this is an old woman, but I always thought that it was a creepy beatnik with a kind of a, you know, one of those beatnik hats with the ball on top. That's what I see here. Your mileage may vary. It hardly matters. We continue onwards. We've skipped the garlic, we've skipped the beatnik that gave us dubious advice. <laughs> Dubious. That's funny to me. Is that funny to you? It's funny to me. How about you there, buddy? Buy some garlic, it has special powers. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. I promise I'm going to buy garlic eventually. I will be wanting it for the silver dagger. Wait, why do I care? We don't need the Silver Dagger. We can get the Gold Dagger for free. Very soon. Okay. Let's, um... Let's reevaluate our strategy. This guy's gonna sell something. I hope it's not laurels. It's laurels. <sighs> We're also going to want some of those by the end of the game. Hell, we're gonna want some as soon as possible. They're very good items, but they're not conducive to where we're going next. It would just be a waste of a thing. I need upgrades, Mr. Staff. This is dress. Ah, here we go. Here's an upgrade. I'd like to exchange a white crystal for a blue one. And if you don't get that right away, you're gonna be screwed. Totally screwed. That's why you have to have the white crystal before you get here. Otherwise, you're toast. Just flat out toast, buddy. You need that blue crystal to get to the next place. Alright. 
will not do the laurels yet. We will, however, go ahead and get that garlic. Because I'm pretty sure there's a graveyard somewhere up here where we'll be needing the garlic. One of these people tells us about that. If we don't cut him off and restart the conversation a couple of dozen times and whatnot. That was... Here we go. Garlic. Man. Now, the thing about garlic is, vampires hate garlic. I, however, love garlic. I use it in all my cooking. I'm not even kidding. I cook with garlic constantly. It's delicious. And if you use the powdered form, you don't get any of the uh, unpleasant smell, but you do get all of the delicious flavor. It's good for you. Try it sometime. Get 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 just like this giant ass tub of garlic powder. Don't get garlic salt because that'll throw your blood pressure through the roof if you use it. All right. Here we have a graveyard. And take a drink. You know, I don't recall if we can do anything in this graveyard at night. But I'm just gonna drop this garlic here. And hopefully that will summon the person we need. It did not. Maybe it's only during the day. Or maybe I'm completely full of shit. That's the more likely scenario. Holy crap. Yeah, there's the person. Give you this shaver night to shave your neck. <laughs> Thanks, there, buddy. I appreciate it. That will really help out. The blue crystal will help out. The silver dagger will help out. But more than any of that, this holy flame will help out. Multiple hits on anything. All right. We could stick around here and. You know, kill some zombies for health, or not health, but hearts. For some reason, I see hearts, I assume health. This is not the case in this game. No, hearts are not health. In fact, they often cause you to die. Especially if you're a minion at Dracula. Holy crap. Okay. I should probably not be walking around in the middle of the night in the middle of the woods. But I'm reckless, baby. Also, there was no um, health restoring church in the last town. Pity that. I'm just gonna hang on to this holy flame because. We're going to be gathering enough hearts from killing things to make up for whatever we use whilst using it. But first we gotta get there from here. Let's take the high road, shall we? See, 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 oh. And I'm on the B team. Not the C team, but the B team. Hey, <laughs> hey. You get it? You get it? Because it, it's an eyeball joke. Ah, never mind. Screw you, eyeballs. I got more balls in my pants than you got in your retinas, you crack bastard. We're not doing this. Oh, oh! Yo, 
Yo. Oh, it got me. I could have gone up there for the first part of the thing. Oh, thank God it's morning. Take a drink. And don't take the low road here. It's a mess. Damn. Why couldn't things turn easy this soon? Now the skeletons are gonna be easier to kill. Also, it's about time to switch to the blue crystal and also back to the holy water. Why the blue crystal? Because there was someone in some town somewhere that gave us a hint that we needed to duck by the lake. So we equip the blue crystal and duck here for five seconds. We go down here. Trust me, it makes kinda sense. But anyway, next mansion. Go ahead and re-equip the um, kick-ass um, shield now. Now, here comes the tricky part. Let's see here. I think we can probably assume that we don't want to go over here, although that I think it's a shortcut. It's almost impossible to make the jump. If you'll recall, we purchased an oak stake during our last uh, mansion run. I mean, we purchased an extra oak stake. That's very important. Let's just throw these Vials like crazy. They beat Count Nefarious Vials. That's an obscure reference. Oh, wow. Well, heck with it. Let's just go here. From there. Why not? I don't think this is the right way, but heck, it may be a shortcut. We'll learn soon enough. This may be a bit sequence breaking, or it may be a big waste of time. Place your bets now. I have terrible memory. Short term memory. So, um, yeah. What was I getting at here? Hell, I don't remember. I'm just gonna take a drink now. <sighs> Love that mansion music. Whoa. That was close. Let's try this again. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, this is one of the bitchier sets of jumps. Because you will hit your head repeatedly on the ceiling. No one likes smacking their head against the ceiling. I'm plum pixelated enough that I will whip my thorn whip through a bunch of dudes with full plate mail. You know you must be pissed if you can whip through plate mail with a leather whip with the thorn on the end. Or whatever the hell. There we go. Gotta jump at the last pixel. I always thought it was a nice effect that they showed the lake up above. Yeah. 
get to live today, skeleton. And I can sense the chamber below us where we use the oak stake blammo. We now possess Dracula's heart. We got a lot of heart. We're like an 80s sports team. Oh, right, spelling error. Take a drink. Hot dog. Might as well have some fun with some of this free stuff we've garnered. Oh, we gotta go around. Pity that. And I screwed that up. Several times in a row, in fact. What miserable jumps these be? Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and get my holy water back on there. Let's let Jackass make mustache here charge forth. And it is with this hand that I throw the holy water. And it is with this hand that I jump forth. Now the best thing to do would be to find myself another oak stake on my way out. But I think this is one of those levels where that's kind of a pain in the ass. Considering how many times I've screwed up, I think it's a given. So let's just get the hell out of here, shall we? Oh yeah. You may have noticed a uh, graphical glitch on the right back there. And I'm not going to jump straight down. Because I'll probably land in water. But there was a graphical glitch to the right here which was some sort of, um, moving platform. Yeah, that's why you don't want to go over there if you can help it. So it's a good thing I bought myself some, um, extra oak stakes. Wow. This dagger sucks. Anyway, either here or there. We can get the hell out of here now. At least we can throw several of them at once. Not that we'd want to. Let's get the heck out of here. Get the heck out of here. Move on to sunny pastures. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And that's the end of that chapter. Except now we have the shitty platforms of doom to contend with. Basically, all that's left is to head back to that first town we were in. That's pretty much all we had to do to the right. Everything else happens to the left. What a waste. What crap. What nonsense. And yet, when you think about it, does geography really make any sense at all? No, it doesn't. Do spiders make any sense? No, they don't. Son of a bitch. Can't believe I dodged all those bastards. That see more scanner. Yeesh. The sensible thing to do would have been to just leave off when I got out of the place with the face. 
but no. 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 I went the extra mile and paid for it. With my very life, no less. Wrong with my head. Oh, this shapen brainiac freak. Cost me more problems. Okay, now I'm not even trying. There's the first mansion. Take a drink. And I still gotta get back across that one bridge. another drink. Wow, this is awkward. Glad I didn't die there. Oh, right in the mess. Okay. Anus ass. That is not cool at all, just putting a skeleton right there, or you move to the next screen. Who does that? There's just no class. It's like school in the summer. Haha! Lemma. Boom! Now mind you, when I get back to town, that'll be a great place to stop, because once the morning comes, I can get myself a nice, delicious church healing. Especially since I keep getting myself blasted in the face with werewolves. I've been slapped by werewolves, tickled by mummies. Etc. Etc. Well, at least the zombies take one hit at this point. Which means there won't be any problem waiting the hideous night out until I can go here in the church and get myself some health back. And also throw holy water like there's no tomorrow with glitch tastic results. So until next time, this is your old pal, sir. Take a drink.